Hello, I'm Renardo Caden, a Senior Partner Solutions Architect at GitLab, and I'm here to talk about GitLab Duo, your AI across the entire software delivery lifecycle. Let's look at the problems an organization faces when trying to ship secure software faster, triaging security vulnerabilities when you don't understand them, and you may not be the original owner, enforcing security standards across the platform while not slowing down developers, siloed planning and project management that weakens collaboration across teams, low quality code in deployment due to lack of testing, and poor developer experience due to context switching and ineffective documentation. These obstacles are made worse without AI throughout the software development lifecycle. And this brings us to our solution, a comprehensive AI powered DevSecOps platform. One that brings together the entire software development lifecycle into a single application. And one that enables a value stream driven mindset, a mindset that is all about going from customer need to customer value with the fastest cycle time possible. GitLab's use of AI across the software delivery lifecycle is wide and deep. And the backbone of it is Vertex AI, from code suggestions to resolving vulnerabilities to merge request information and issue summarization, Vertex AI is key in making those AI-powered features possible. Being a DevSecOps platform, we help teams go from idea to software faster. So this illustrates how teams go from collaboration to pushing code to the repository, to securing it and scanning it, all the way to deployment. With AI, this even made more effective and efficient. Thanks to technologies like CodeGecko and CodeBison, part of the Kodi API, GitLab Duo's functionality makes it helpful for teams to secure and deploy their applications with ease and efficiency. Okay, so I'll do my best to explain the architecture uh, of AI at GitLab in a very simplistic and easy inter to understand manner. Now, at the top of this diagram, you will see where the users or customers are. Now, whether it's your local IDE, like VS Code or JetBrains, or the web front end at gitlab.com or your self-managed instance, all of them will need to access the AI gateway. Now, this AI gateway provides an access layer, which then will be able to connect to the third-party services that will power the AI features, you know, these is where the features that will get the prompts and then provide the appropriate response, whether it's code gecko or code bison, our own um, models or other third party models. This is how we are able to connect to services and bring it back to our customers. Let me give you a quick demo and sampling of GitLab's AI capabilities. Now, suppose you're uh, you know, a new engineer, a new developer, just joining a team, and you've been tasked to modify a simple credit card fraud detector written in Python. Now, typically, I would try to understand my the files that I'm trying to modify and the code that I'm trying to modify. So I can do that using um, GitLab Duo, um, just like one of the files here. Now I could uh, select a code snippet and from GitLab Duo's um, UI, I could type in a slash command for explain. Now once that's happening, you can see on the left side of the screen, GitLab Duo will analyze the selected code snippet, will provide a very good explanation. And I could go as far as selecting the whole thing, right? Now, once I have a better grasp of the source code, I can start you know, adding into it. I can add more lines like import um, something. Yep. Again, these are set simple line additions. Um, and I could even add, for example, a new variable here. Um, uh, let's say here. No. So again, these are examples of how uh, Kodi API can help um, our 
AI capabilities with these code uh, completion features. Okay. Okay, once I've pushed my code into the main repository, I will kick off a pipeline uh, in, the, in the CI CD, we'll try to build and deploy the application that I've just um, pushed and merged. Now, suppose there's a, a problem with the pipeline and I you know I could look at the logs and try to sift through this and see what's happening. I could actually use the root cause analysis feature on GitLab, which will try to explain and summarize this uh, very long set of logs, uh, generate root cause, root cause analysis, and then actually give me um, a set of recommendations and example fixes that I could consider to fix this issue. Again, very helpful, you know, not just, you know, creating the code, but also fixing some of the issues that may occur from the uh, additions that I've made into my application. And finally, for this demo, I want to show you how GitLab and AI can help make your application and deployments more secure. Now, I'm at the vulnerability report screen of that same GitLab project. And here are some of the vulnerabilities that were picked up in the pipeline when it was scanned. Now, I could choose one of these, like this one, the more um, severe one. And look at the top right, there's already a resolve with AI capability, where if I click it, it will start to create a merge request in the GitLab project, and it will try to address the um, vulnerability. There will be a generated content, um, and a pipeline will be uh, kicked off, and this will try to address that um, vulnerability. And that concludes the demo. With GitLab Duo, you're able to use AI across software development lifecycle, not just code creation, but also in securing application, understanding how the pipeline is deployed, and making your application more secure.